Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a really cool video prepared for you all. My friends over at Tropical Isle Roti Shop sent me this box filled with amazing sweets, snacks, baked goods, and all of their homemade goodies that they sell. Now, if you're interested in checking out Tropical Isle, they are located at 11819 Liberty Avenue in Queens, New York. Make sure you check them out because they are your one-stop shop for all of your roti, your baked goods, like your pastries, your pine tart, your flatbread, all of that kind of good stuff. They also make a lot of different sweet treats like fudge and sugar cake, and they also have a lot of savory options as well. Now, for all of my friends and family that are not located right there in Queens, New York, and it's not as easy to get to Tropical Isle Roti Shop, they've come up with a way to go ahead and get all of this delicious food to you guys. Now, of course, this is more just for the baked goods and the dal puri and roti and things like that. All right, so let's get into this box. So I've already cracked open the top for you guys and I'm gonna put it down here just so I can reach into it and show you guys what's in here. But we've got a nice little thank you note on the top and of course you've got your address, the phone number, email, all of that good stuff. I'm gonna have it linked in the description box right below this video. They also sent a little card or instruction card to share how you can enjoy all of your sweet treats and your breads, pastries, dal puri, all that kind of stuff. For your dal puri, all you need to do is wrap it up in a paper towel Heat it up in the microwave for a couple of seconds, depending on how hot you want it, and it'll get that nice soft dal puri that Tropical Isle is known for making. And of course, if you want to enjoy your pastries as well, heat them up in the microwave for just a couple seconds as well, and they're going to be great. Now, for me, um, I've already had their pastries before after ordering them and taking them elsewhere. I went to school somewhere far away from New York, so I bought a lot of their pastries in bulk when I was ready to go back to school. And what I would do is I would freeze them. I would put them in Ziploc bags and pop them in the freezer. And um, so speaking from experience, I've always had access to their amazing stuff even before they had the shipping. And same thing, all I would do was take their pastries out of the freezer, pop them into a plate or wrap them up in a wet paper towel and I would just heat everything up. Same goes with the dal puri. Everything always came out soft. It was nice and fresh still, super delicious. So just make sure you package them correctly if you're gonna save them or put them in the fridge and um, you can enjoy them anytime at home. So the first thing that I'm seeing when I'm opening this up is this beautiful flatbread. It's nice and soft and spongy, exactly what Tropical Isle is always known for making. They have one of the best breads on Liberty Avenue in my opinion. And going a little deeper, I've got the tennis roll as well. Their tennis rolls are also really delicious. Just go ahead and break them apart, add in a nice little layer of butter or a thick slice of cheese and you're good to go. And another one of their amazing treats is their plantain chips. This is a family favorite. Everybody loves snacking on something all the time. They've got this. They've also got their fried chana, their fried dal and they also make chicken foot or salseo. And um, for like a sweet crunchy snack, they also have the crunchy matai as well that you can order. I also wanted to mention that in transit, these were not at all broken up. Just maybe a couple pieces at the bottom, but you can see that all of these pieces are nice and whole at the top. And some of the other treats I got in here are some of my favorites that they sell. I got two pieces of fudge here. So this is like their sugar cake on um, milk powder fudge. Um, so it's got like coconut and milk powder. Same things that the white fudge has in it, but it has the coconut, similar to a sugar cake. And they make it into these two different colors. This one is really, really delicious, especially if you love coconut. And this one right here is your classic milk powder fudge. I've seen them make this before. It's definitely a labor of love and they make it so amazing. You know, the texture's perfect. It melts in your mouth. One of my favorites. And if you're into like para or a brown fudge type of deal, they also have the brown fudge on the menu that you can order as well. And right here is my box of pastries. So you know at Tropical Isle when you're ordering pastries, you can get those amazing cheese rolls, you can get pine tart, chiny cake or black eye, you can get Solara, you can get all kinds of different things. Now they're not chipping their chicken patties, but their chicken patties are really, really good. So side note, if you want good chicken patties, head on over to Tropical Island. And inside of this box, I also have some Solara. Now in my opinion, they make the best Solara out of all the roti shops and bakeries that I have tried before. Now I say this because the flakes of the coconut inside are not regular flakes of coconut that are just grated super big. They're a little more fine than that. And for everybody that bakes all of these things homemade, 
you know that when we make Solara at home, we don't grate it on the big side of the grater. We put it down onto that um, old fashioned um, coconut grater that you sit down and grate on, or we put it in the food processor sometimes just to get a very fine texture. The bread is soft, I'm feeling it. And you know that when you're getting Solara or red bread and you see that it's nice and super red and it's soaking into the bread, you know that it's very juicy, it's moist, and um, not dry and crumbly like some places might have it. And lastly, I want to get into one of my favorites as well. This is more of a savory item and they're shipping this and they're also shipping their roti. This right here is their dal puri. Now I went there and I saw the ladies in the back making dal puri and roti and they're there all day rolling, belaying roti, mixing roti, oiling roti, the whole nine yards, all day. They don't make roti and let it sit all day. Let me show you guys what they look like. Look at that. Three beautiful dal puri, all packed up. Look at that. And let me tell you guys, their dal puri is super flavorful, super soft. One of my favorites. Trust me, trust me, trust me. If you head on over to Tropical Isle Roti Shop, you're going to get some of the freshest, most delicious pastries, food items, roti, anything you can imagine. Of course, Please go ahead and support them in their new venture on shipping these amazing pastries, dal puri, roti, all kinds of stuff. Just head on over to their website, tropicalislerotishop.com. And again, I'll have that, all of that information in the description box right below the video. You can go ahead and view all of the different items that they sell, click on them, put in the quantities you want, add your payment information, address, all of that good stuff, and everything's going to be shipped fresh properly packaged to your door. And little quick updates, I wanted to mention to you all that for the rest of the month of June, they are doing a pack of free tennis rolls, so a pack of six tennis rolls, free with your order if you spend $30 or more. So once again, thanks to my friends over at Tropical Isle Roti Shop. I hope you all enjoyed this quick little video today, and I hope you all check it out. And while you guys are going to their website to check out all the deliciousness they've got on there, I'm gonna go break into this bad boy slather it with some butter, and drink my cup of coffee. See you all again in my next video. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, drop those comments down below. Let me know if you tried out any of their delicious items, what your favorite items are, and how you enjoyed them. I'll see you guys again with another one of my videos. Bye, everyone.